Good day, it's Tuesday. We just had a bank holiday, so I feel like this is the beginning of the week officially. I always feel like bank holidays are just an extension of the weekend, therefore it's from the week before. I'm just making the bed with you on it. <laughs> I'm planning on going on a run today. I feel a bit gross. I've not really not exercised much recently. Well, not as much as I'd liked. I'm gonna go for a little run, and then I've got stuff that I wanna do, like catch up on, work stuff. I'm gonna get back for my run. I'm going to put some Olaplex on and wash my hair because I haven't washed it in ages. <laughs> it's tied up in a bun. <laughs> you just don't notice it when it's tied up. Do a little tidy up and then, yeah, edit some stuff, smash out some stuff. Feeling good and productive and positive today. I'm feeling like it's going to be a good day. That's something on the lens. Hey. So, I'm just having a bit of a walk. <sighs> so hard. I'm not a runner. I've done like two kilometres and I've had to just walk for a bit that's just the breathing man i know everyone's saying do couch to 5k which i will do i've got the app on my phone but it's one of those oh i gotta pay do you have to pay for it i'm not against paying for it but it's just another, another fucking subscription to think about isn't it i could be wrong though um yeah it's boiling yeah so i'm just walking we'll get a pace on again i don't i don't run it's jogging in it very fast either Cardio, in it. I feel like I've got my breath back now. Let's do it again. <laughs> Done a vlog, edit a vlog, gonna all the the hair. Got a load of clothes to clear up now. It's embarrassing. I'm such a bad person. We're tidy now. Gonna go wash out the Olaplex. Carry on listening to Stevie Wonder. Sort my life out and then I'm having some lunch because I'm hungry. Look at the Olaplex has made my hair go brown. My lunch is great. It's just a leftover of chicken, some salad and a little bit of leftovers from my picnic yesterday. A little bit of quiche, a little bit of hummus. It's great. I love leftover dinners or leftover lunches. Mm. I'm done for the day, done at my desk. Oh, why do I, I always feel like when I do a full day at my desk, it feels like I've actually been to work or done work. Gonna go walk the girls. Gonna go walk the girls now. Lead, lead. So I just fill it up with cold water. Up to the line, uh, or up to the, there. And then I'll go. <laughs> then I'll just unscrew it. Oh, cool! Okay. Ooh, cool! I did a walk just around the block. I just used it. So, so strips of fun. Gonna water the plants, but I'm not gonna use the sprinkler. I'm just gonna do it by hand. I think I need to have some one to one time with my, my plants. You should talk to them on the rigs. Makes them happy. I'm just hoping the, this makes my hair nice and wavy for tomorrow. The tools on the table. Yeah. Cool. Wax on the table. Tools Lovely. On the table. You've got a drink there. Got my drink here. Just sweet. Favorite part of my day. This is my screen in bed. <laughs> my house is so dusty. Good morning. Ah, actually, it's midday now. I have had like a a, a morning to myself to be a person i went for a 5k run then i did boot camp but i did space it out over like all morning because it did take me a while to oh no 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 i did my run in about half an hour and i got home and had a coffee and, and just chilled for an hour and then i did my boot camp and i got dressed and i filmed a tiktok i'm like an old fucking lady when it comes to tiktok seriously i'm so slow at it so it did take me time but um yeah i, t I filmed a tiktok down with the kids down with the kids I'm just gonna put my converse on. I'm gonna go down to this. Gotta go down to the studio and film video for my main channel. I reckon I can do it in a minute. I've got an hour before a meeting, an online Skype meeting, so can I do it? 
fucking thing, shall we? Right, okay, okay. I've done all my work for the day. And I've had a meeting. I'm gonna go to the seaside with the children. Ah, that is cool. Oh my god, I'm the worst. Ah! My legs. Um, so, just to review the day, I um, got up, I ran, I boot camped over a period of time. I'm not on a fucking machine, but I spent the morning working out. It was nice. In my own time. Lovely. Got ready, filmed TikTok, filmed the main channel video, and then we went to the beach this afternoon for a little walk. Came home, had dinner, I had a bath, used. Oh, what? What bath bomb did I use? I think it was my sleepy one. Looks like a cloud. Well, nice. Um, washed my face. I had hot chocolate in the bath. It was lush. I used this Sun Dupre tanning mist. Um, so fingers crossed it doesn't look terrible in the morning. We've just watched an episode of Vikings. I'll put on an episode of the Chin Review because <laughs> of some Instagram filter that I saw. It's well good. But yeah, I've been a bit um slack with this today I apologise but tomorrow I'm really excited because um, I'm going to do some work in the morning and then I'm going to go meet Josie for lunch in town we have pre-ordered Pono with Pono which is a place that we would always used to go to for lunch which do, do poke bowls and they you can pre-order you can pick it up and we're going to sit in the park and eat it and we're also going to get a Starbucks because Starbucks on Gentleman's Walk in Norwich is open and I'm so excited so I'm gonna ride my bike into town, go meet Jace, have some luck, come back. I'm so excited. It's gonna feel a little bit like like a normal activity, going for lunch in town. Bedtime. See you in the morning. I'm gonna do a boot camp in the morning. I just seen it. Cat posted it on um on, on the Facebook page. Looks well tough. Oh yeah, one other thing. I posted an ad on my IGTV. They're using the um hair apology range which I've actually really love I when I washed my hair with it for the first time he went god you smell great and I'm like it's my shampoo my hair I washed it with this stuff it's good well good I've used it like like loads I love it and they're doing a little this isn't an ad by the way but I just like to let you all know of great things if you use the code Helen15 on the Lee Stafford site 15% discount well good um this is an hashtag ad but yeah, just being nice yeah anyway i'm gonna be come on you granger hair look at this harry ron harry ron i don't think we should do this harry and ron harry ron stop harry ron Hello, um, I'm having a bit of a day. I did some working out um, and then I, my, my body hurts too much. I've done two rounds out of three and then I quit. But I've been dancing, I've been dancing. Um, my back hurts, my legs hurt. My back is doing it, doing my head in at the minute, but I'm, I'm finishing some filming this morning. Hey. Okay, I'm done. We're done filming in the office. Hey. Now for some lunch and see JC, I, I actually kind of hate this bike. It's so impractical. It's clunky. It's heavy. It's really. It's a, it's alright to ride. But if you want to go like bezin on a proper bike ride, this ain't the one. This is just for commuting to and from nice places that aren't too hard to cycle to. And helmet. I'm gonna GoPro my journey. Eee. What? See you in town. <laughs> Shut up. That last hill just got me. <sighs> Flippin' made it, didn't we? Flippin' made it. Here's my gal, holding the goods, ready to go. Me too. Let's do it. 
We're gonna get, where are we going now, Josie? Stop. Stop. <laughs> yep. Do you know what else is basic, Jose? Me carrying my Louis Vuitton in my <laughs> back basket. <laughs> so happy, Josie. I got my Josie. Ew, keep away from me. <laughs> uh, we got our Pono, we got a Starbucks. My first ever Starbucks coffee. See, do you know what quarantine has done to Jose? It's got her into coffee. So I just thought I didn't like it. I think it's because I didn't like coffee flavoured things like coffee cake or. And then my boyfriend was like, oh, I'll just have a sip. So I was like, that smells quite nice. And then ever since, I now love coffee. One perk of quarantine. Do you know what? I never have it with like caramel in it, but that tastes like an American Starbucks, that does. Isn't that, that is good? good? We got al almond milk, American, it went, it's not cold brew, they didn't have any, but that's a nice like, iced Americano. That's a nice Americano with almond milk and a shot of ca caramel. Bitch. Look at this. <laughs> la, 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 la. And then this. And you haven't had the salmon one before, no, have you? Oh, so good. How was the uh, Pono? And your Starbucks? Very good. That's the first time I've had the, the Pokey Bowl. Yeah? Pokey, Pokey, Pokey Bowl. Very good. They're always very good though. Very fresh. And coffee was very good. It's a lot stronger than I thought. Maybe because I've only had Cafe Azira, Nescafe Azira. What we can go for coffee? coffees together. Yeah. Like, I'll go now, I'll go when I go to Starbucks. You won't be like, I'll have a peach iced tea. I'll be like, yeah. have the hard I'll shit, like Jose. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I better put that close my, my flask up. It might leak. <laughs> Do you like it? Yeah. You always got to keep hydrating. It's a nice little size just to go in, Louie. Oh, I'll tell you what you'd like. Those tea pig tea the bags. Thing. They're well yeah. good. You'd like, the, they do a peach one. You'd sh shit the bed over that. Yeah. You love that, you would. Ah, oh, would be, oh yeah, iced tea. Oh, you give me an idea. <laughs> Gonna make some. Luckily, the majority of the journey home is downhill. <laughs> safely and in one piece I'm just sat here at my desk editing tonight's video that's going to go up a week of outfits um god my body hurts so much <gasps> I might not exercise tomorrow the video is live I'm just I don't know why I'm watching it back I'm just watching it back when it's, it's already uploaded though and I'm just going to put these away let's have my dinner spaghetti meatballs with sauce and I've got chicken, I've got chicken mush, I've got chicken meatballs. I don't really eat beef, I don't eat beef. Like, once in a blue moon I'll have something beefy, but I don't like to eat beef. I only really like to eat chicken and fish. Um, but I've got these chicken meatballs from Tesco, from where the chicken bits are, like chicken, chicken! Where you would find chicken in Tesco, they do these little, they're called like Mediterranean meatballs. My God, they were insane. We had it with some linguine and we had some pasta sauce and I chopped up some onion and some garlic and we had some garlic bread and it was amazing. New babies, new babies. Friday, gardening done, doing day. So I popped a bin queue to get some lavender lawn stuff, some cuprinol in black for the exterior paint. And I needed some hooks and some wire for the training of the wisteria. But we're gonna go now to Urban Jungle now that it's open in Norwich. And uh, I just wanted to go. I'm, I've been desperate for that to wake to open up. I love it there. 
So we're going to pop to there. And then I'm going to spend the rest of the day doing stuff, pottering. <laughs> I've just been to garden centres buying plants. Can't stop. I will show you what I've done today though. I'm growing some wisteria. As you can see, it's right here. What I did was I got this kit from B&Q, which is just like a wire. It's a climbing plant kit. And it's a quite a thick metal cable. And I've drilled four points into my wall and it's gonna go up, across, down. And then when it gets down to there, I'm gonna make it go back up here or back up. And it's gonna eventually go around the house. Um, so it's gonna be a, probably a while soon then, but I reckon it will grow quite a fair bit this summer. Um, I also got another, put another one here with some green wire. I've got some wisteria coming through the fence. I know it might damage the fence, but we'll just wait and see. My neighbor, he was like, do you want that bit? I went, yeah, go on in. So I got some lawn stuff and I got this today, which is well handy uh, for my sprinkler. It's a timer, so I can just put it on for as long as I want, for as, well, for as long as I need. And it will just do its thing. I also upgraded my sprinkler because the one I bought previously was shit. Got some more lavender, I bought some more verbenas. Um, I'm just I'm just trying to tidy up the pathway because it's a bit scratty. I've taken out some old lavender. That was so, it just pulled out in my hand. It was so dead. Um, but I'm just gonna make it a purple walkway, basically. And then I just got some of these to go in here. I'm gonna pull this guy out. He's only just gone in, but so I'm gonna dig him out. I'm not happy with his positioning because I know that he's gonna be a slow grower. Whereas I'm trying to get everything big to go at the back. So these two, these grow quite big. So that'll go there to cover up that gap. And then I got these things, two red, orange and red rocket looking plants on them. So they're gonna go maybe there, I don't know. Ugh, I'm gonna make a chicken pie now. Friday, Friday, we're doing this one. But we don't have a pie dish, so I'm gonna have to make a square pie. And Sausage Pig is trying to find the rest of the remains. Where are you? No, no, no. Happy Saturday. I've come to Goulston today to visit dearest Ben. I haven't seen Ben in so long. And we're having a little beach day, and Edna's here! Edna. <laughs> <laughs> she likes to think and then roll in it. <laughs> she stopped now, but look, she just made such a mess. <laughs> oh dear! <laughs> miss him. Takeaway on a Saturday. Rick Pizza, Norwich, Norwich, Norwich's finest. <laughs> the beauty is out. Oh yeah. Okay. Oh, he shut the door. All oh, right. Okay. We're going on a bike ride today. We're going to go down Marriott's Way. It goes from Norwich to Reefham. We might make it to Reefham. Depends how fast we go, but I've said, I oh, it's a fucking race. He's got a proper bike, like a proper, is it a road bike? Yeah. Yeah, whereas I've got this. Well, it's like an old vintage. It's an old vintage one. Vintage road bike-ish. Whereas I've got this heap of metal. Let's go. Right, we start, we cycle to the starting point, which is right next to Halfords of Norwich. That's where Duncan works. Hello, Duncan. And then it's just this path up here, which goes for a, a, quite a while. So.
made it to a train station. Well, it's not a functioning one, but it's nice. We're having picnics. Ah. Oh my God! What are they came for ice cream. They got beer. They got beer. Yeah, we could either keep going mm. round the footpath to Reefham, like round on this path, and then come off at Reefham. Mm -hmm. Lamb. Uh, Lamb. So we took another wrong turn and ended up going further than the uh, destination, the end destination. So what we're going to do is not bother going to the end destination because oh, it's just a place called Reefham, but nothing will be open. And we're going to just go back to that little train station where. There was a little takeaway cafe which had beer. Just stopped here and we had a beer. And our packed lunch. Ham sandwich, pack of discos. <laughs> Prawn cocktail. It's time to head back. We're back. I'm shattered. I'm shattered. I'm just doing a bit of housework and watering the plants. He's gone out to play tennis. He's shattered too. He's like, I've got to go out and play tennis now. Oh yeah, I'm just doing some housework. Watering the plants, got my sprinkler on. Gonna write a list of things to do tomorrow. Ugh. Feeling a bit like, got loads of stuff to do. This show is about these Canadian people. They say hey a lot, doing up cars. Well cool. Well cool. Oh, I'm so tired. What a fantastic week it's been for us. an old friend of Mike's own father, stopped by with a special gift. Stop the cap off my dad's car. Good night.